good morning students last class we have discussed about cost price selling price profit and loss today we going to learn about overheads so what is overheads sometimes the price of an object increases due to their expenses like transportation shop rent salaries etc so these are called overheads and are ordered to the cost price for example you know so pimala making one bag that cost price is 363 when somebody outside her city buys the bag Pimala spends seventy five rupees on packing, packing and postal charges. So she spends extra amount for packing and postal charges. So these kind of charges called overheads. So the overheads, overheads amount always added to cost price. So let's see, let's see one sum. Cost price that is nine hundred nine. Overheads one hundred sixty two. Selling price thousand two hundred thirty five. So now we going to find final cost price. So how will you find final cost price? If you add cost price and overheads, you will get final cost price. So nine plus two eleven. So remaining one, one plus six seven, nine plus one ten. So final cost price is final cost price rupees thousand seventy one. So selling price they given that is rupees. Thousand two hundred thirty-five. Now we can find this is profit or loss. See which is greater. So selling price is greater than the final cost price. So selling price greater than final cost price. So this is profit. So selling price subtract. Final cost price. What is selling price amount? Rupees thousand two hundred thirty five. What is final cost price? Thousand seventy one. So subtract five minus one. That is four. Three minus seven. So we can borrow from before number. So two convert to one, the three convert to thirteen. So thirteen minus seven. What is the answer? It is six. So the one you just bring down. One minus one that is zero. So therefore profit is rupees. Hundred sixty-four. So, if they given overheads, you should add the overheads to cost price. Then you get final cost price. Then you can compare with selling price whether it is profit or loss. Here, selling price is more than the final cost price. So, this is profit. So, you can subtract. Final cost price from selling price, you can get profit amount. Thank you, students.